Namaste guys and welcome back. So in this video we are going to learn how to make a simple 4 bar mechanism in Blender. So let's get start. So click on stop first. Now click on file, click new, click general. Don't save it. Now press 3. Press X and delete this. Now go to add. Click on armature. Now press slash mark in the numpad. Now little bit zoom out. Now go to the edit mode. Select this. Press shift plus D. Press G and Y. Move it little by word axis. Now press S and 2. Press enter. Press G and Z. Move a little upward. Ok. After that, select this uh, head, this tail, sorry. Press E, extrude it. Similarly, select this tail, press E and extrude it. Select this tail, press Shift plus S, press cursor to be selected. Select this tail, press Shift plus S, selection to cursor. Ok. Now, Go to pose mode. Select this bone and this bone by pressing shift. After that press ctrl plus shift plus c. Click on inverse kinematics. Here you can see your bone constraint. So I have done a mistake. First you need to select this bone. After that by pressing shift select this bone and then press ctrl plus shift plus c. Click on inverse kinematics. Make sure that the chain length is 2. Here currently its chain length is 0. So if I try to rotate it, you can see. It's working correctly. So basically in 2.8 version, if I try to rotate it, it doesn't rotate correctly. So basically you need to uh, give the chain length 2 so that it can know that the correct chain length is 2 for example 1 and 2 so it telling me that the number of uh, components after the after this bond is 2 so that is the reason we put chain length 2 uh, remember in 2.8 version i have tried this method uh, for example when there is length 0 so basically i got the wrong results as you can see here i am getting the correct result but in previous versions i am getting the wrong results so that is the reason even I am real shocked uh, why I am getting this. So but by convention method remember the chain length is 2. Ok. Now, uh, now you can animate this. So simply press uh, select this bone, press N. And uh, make sure that you use Euler, uh, XYZ Eulerian. Now press I. Move it little forward for example 30. And move Z. Okay, no, Z is not the correct axis. Y also not the correct axis. It's X. So and move X to 700 degree. Press I. Decrease the number of keyframes. 35. Click on play button. Here you can see. You can increase or decrease the speed of the frame rate as per your requirement. Click on spacebar. Now add object as per the requirement. Click on add. Click on cube. S, Y, S, Z. Grab Z. Scale Y. Sorry, scale Z. Grab Z. Uh, press numpad. 3 scale x axis uh, you see the red line so red line basically represent x axis y line basically represent green axis and z line basically represent blue axis here you can see so this is a conventional uh, symbols of for axis uh, it doesn't matter whatever 3d software you use uh, these are the basic symbols of convention now select this press shift plus d Grab Y, scale Z, 
टू एंटर जी जेड के लिटल विट डाउन इन जेड एक्सिस सेलेक्ट सेलेक्ट दिस प्लस शिफ्ट प्लस डी रोटेट ग्रैब स्केल आउटवर्ड नॉन पैड वन स्केल एक्स ग्रैब एक्स नाउ we need to parent these objects with the bones so let's see how to do it first select the object after that go to the these modes okay select the object first after that press shift and select the bone now go to the pose mode and press control plus p click on bone similarly go back to your object mode select this and press shift and the bones click on pause mode press control plus p bone now remember you need to first select the object after that the bone if you first select the bone and then you will select the object it will not going to work properly for example i select the bone this time first and the object second now you will see i doesn't get the pause mode so you first need to select always the object mode after that you need to select the bone and remember in blender you need to press shift to select objects okay not control now press shift uh, the blue when you press shift and these two parts highlighted it means that you have selected it if they are not highlighted it means they are not selected press control plus p click on bone now press number 3 uh simply select all these click on slash icon in the numpad now zoom in click on play the side of the amateurs so this is how to make a four bar mechanism in blender i hope you guys learn something from it if you have any doubts and queries Make sure that you ask in comments. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Namaste.